Picture this. You're a freelancer working from a cozy cafe in Mumbai. You need to check your bank account quickly. You connect to the cafe's Wi-Fi, enter your login details, and someone just copied your username and password. Here's how it happened. Here's exactly what a hacker uses to intercept your data. DVWA. Simulating a banking website without HTTPS protection. Burp Suite. The interception tool that captures everything. A standard browser, just like yours. This is Burp Suite. Think of it as a digital wiretap for web traffic. I'm setting up a proxy on 192.168.1.145 port 8080. In a real attack, this could be disguised as the cafe's actual Wi-Fi router. Now watch this. I'm configuring Firefox to route through my hacker proxy. This could happen if you connect to a fake Wi-Fi hotspot called CCD Free instead of the real Cafe Coffee Day Free. Manual Proxy Configuration 192.168.1.145 port 8080. In a coffee shop attack, this would be the hacker's computer IP address. This is how network traffic gets redirected with all traffic flowing through the attacker's computer first. I'm turning on intercept and burp. This means every single request gets captured before reaching the real server. Your bank thinks you're connecting directly, but you're not. Now I'm at what looks like a typical banking portal. I'll enter credentials, admin, and password. Here's the moment your financial life gets compromised. When I click login, instead of going to the bank, the request gets intercepted. Look at this, sitting right here in Burp Suite, waiting for the hacker to examine it. There it is, your banking username and password in plain text. Username equals admin, password equals password. This is why HTTPS is crucial for banking sites. Without that lock icon, you're broadcasting your financial life to everyone on the network. Now the hacker has options, and none of them are good for you. They could modify your transaction amount, redirect you to a fake banking site, or simply store your credentials for later use. For this demo, I'll forward the original request to see the server response. The bank processes the login successfully. You see your account balance, think everything is fine, and continue with your day in the cafe. But the damage is done. Your credentials are now in the hacker's database. The technique we just saw works anywhere you have unencrypted login forms. These are all vulnerable on public Wi-Fi. You now know exactly how banking credentials get stolen on public Wi-Fi. If this video will change how you use cafe Wi-Fi, smash that like button. Subscribe for more cybersecurity content that protects your digital life. Comment below, which cafe do you work for most? Let's keep each other safe. DVWA and Burp Suite download links are below. Stay secure and see you next time.